Good afternoon, everyone. We're running a little late today. Uh, Mark was up last night, so he slept in this morning. Uh, he's going to be reading, continuing his reading in Matthew 5. And he's starting with verses 28. And he's going to read down to, to the end of the chapter. Good morning, Mark. How are you doing? Yeah. Okay, so you start there at 28, and you'll just read down through the end of the chapter, all right? Yeah. Try to read loudly. So 28 through 35. 28 through 48. Okay. I say to you that you You're going to have to read loud, because okay. that volume yeah, is not working very well. But I say unto you that whosoever looketh on a woman to lust after her hath committed adultery with her already in his heart. And if thy right eye offend thee, pluck it out and cast it from thee. It would profitable for thee that one of thy members should perish, and not that thy whole body should be cast into hell. If thy right hand offend thee, cut off and cast it from thee. It would profitable for thee that one of thy members should perish, and not that thy whole body should be cast into hell. It hath been said, Whoever shall put away his wife, let him give her right of divorcement. I say unto you that whosoever shall put away his wife's sake for the cause of fornication, the cause of her to commit adultery, and whosoever shall marry her to the divorce for adultery. Again, ye have heard that it hath been said by them old time, Thou shalt not forswear thyself, and shalt perform with the Lord by notes. But I say unto you, Swear not at all in my heaven, for his God throne, by the earth, for it is his footstool, near by Jerusalem, for it is the city of the great king. Neither shalt thou swear by thy head, because thou canst not make one hair white or black. But let your communication be yea, yea, nay, nay, for whatsoever is more than these cometh of evil. Ye have heard that it hath been said, an eye for an eye, and a tooth for a tooth. But I say unto you that ye resist not evil. But whosoever shall smite thee on thy right cheek, turn to him. Other also. If any man will sue thee at the law and take away thy coat, let him have thy cloak also. Okay. Whosoever shall sorry. Whosoever shall compel thee to go a mile and go with him twain. Give to him the ass of thee for him that would borrow thee, turn not thou away. Ye have heard that it hath been said, Thou shalt love thy neighbor and hate thine enemy, but I say unto you, Love your enemies, bless them that curse you. Do good that hate you, and pray for them which is finally use you and persecute you. That you may be the children of your Father which is in heaven, for he make the son to rise from the evil and on the good, and send for rain on the just and on the unjust. For if ye love them which love you, what reward have ye? Do not eat the public and say, Is that 40 cares? 40 cares. If you salute your brethren only, what do ye more than others? Do eat public and so. Okay. Be ye therefore perfect, even as your Father which is in heaven. Okay, well, thank you, Mark. Yeah. And hope you have a good afternoon.